Staying safe around water as temperatures heat up, sadly drownings tend to increase with more people headed to the pools and lakes. In the last 24 hours, a four-year-old boy drowned in Mesa and a five-year-old boy is in the hospital right now after being pulled from the pool in Phoenix. So what can we do to protect our loved ones around water? ABC 15's Patrick Hayes takes a closer look at this issue. You know, it, it, it tears my heart every time, even after all these years, uh, when I hear an incident, especially when it goes fatal. Jay Arthur is a retired firefighter and the president of the Drowning Prevention Coalition of Arizona. He says Monday's drowning and near drowning in the valley reminds him of responding to similar calls. We don't like telling people, but uh, the... Uh, drownings that we have are preventable. The coalition recommends having a designated person watching the kids in the pool. They also suggest having some kind of fence, but says that can be expensive. What you can do as a uh, parents are secure the access to the backyard pool, especially if it's unfenced, extra locks on the door, alarms on the doors. You have doggy doors that lead out to the pool. You can secure those. According to state data, 30 children in Arizona died from drowning in 2022. The most common risk factors, a lack of supervision, an inability to swim, and a lack of a barrier, like a fence. Here in Phoenix, the city is offering swimming lessons for everyone from toddlers to adults for just $15. Are we opening one pool that previously hadn't been opened? City spokesperson Adam Waltz says pools will start opening up next month. We're very excited. I think people don't realize how important city pools are until the temperatures start climbing up and with that how important swim lessons are and how important it is to know how to swim. Jump! On top of swim lessons, city pools have safety equipment and lifeguards. Our lifeguards are very well trained. Our pool managers and assistant managers keep an eye on the water. But always swim with your kids. Be that first line of defense, that touch contact, and just create memories with them in the pool. You know, get off your phone, come swim with your kids, and have a safe summer. In Phoenix, Patrick Hayes, ABC 15, Arizona.